too late. We got the last two quid out yesterday. It must be phone, Anna. But, well, this is the problem with these modern handsets, isn't it? They're just too small. Should have seen the size of my first one. All right, don't panic. In a minute now, we'll be listening to that irritating ringtone. No, no, It's ringing out. It's not flaming here, is it? Well, where did you have it last? Well, I don't know, though. It wouldn't be lost, would it? Come here. Come here. What? You've been scrapping again. Not I fell over. Well, it better not have been on somebody's head. <sighs> Tell me where you were last night. I'll give him a ring. Somebody might have handed it in. Mm, yeah, as if. Look, if it's gone, then it's gone for good, hasn't it? Your work. Very much. If you could maybe stop your son from feeding in trolls, that'd be great. <sighs> Pearl, that's either a really bad panda impression or you've smudged your mascara a lot. <sighs> I just had some bad news and there are no more tissues. Oh, use mine. Yeah. Bad news? Well, Lily's just phoned. Alan's back in hospital again. Alan? He's not crashed his trike again, has he? What's the damage? Well, they were on the way to the ferry to come home, and they stopped in Brittany at this roadside taverna. Oh, no, sorry, uh, taverna's Greece. Uh, it's an auberge in France, or a brasier. Brassy. Brasserie. The next thing you knew, he was at death's door. His hip is infected. I mean, obviously, he tried to walk before he could run. It's like a flipping advert for taking out medical insurance when you go away, isn't it? Lily's furious. She said the place she's stopping, but the plumbing's diabolical. <sighs> but the main thing is he's all right, is he? Yes. Right, well, that's good. <clears throat> you can tell me about him later. In, in the meantime, can you just get that? Oh, yeah. Hello. Uh, this is Paddy Kirk's mobile phone. Oh, I see. Um, uh, can you hold the line a moment, please? Uh, there's a man on the phone. Um, he said you rang about a lost phone. Oh. Hello? Can I help you? Well, that's great. You found it. It's the vet surgery in Emmerdale. Thank you. See you then, then. Bye-bye. So you haven't lost your phone? Well, there's no fleas on you. Flies. Tiny Brownlee, please. <laughs> He's got my number anyway, so you just have to give me a call any time. I'm sure you shouldn't be on Mr. Carl's computer. Yeah, like you'd be bothered I'm checking out my horoscope online. And I would be grateful if you didn't leave any crumbs. Oh. Mm. We can wait for him here. What on earth is going on? I thought you were ill. Yeah, so did I until I caught a scoff in a burger in the cafe. Oh, you can't blame the kid, can you? Stay at your cooking. I might have known you wouldn't back me up. Ladies, please. Just give her a break, will ya? We all did daft things at her age. Not only some of us grow up. Right, well, let's just get her home and forget all about it, eh? Fine by me. I will not tell an untruth to my employer. Yeah, and unless Carl wants a growing up like one of your lot, he's got to put his foot down. What's wrong with my lot? Your errands and Asbo waiting to happen, for starters. Listen, I warned you. It's probably the booze you're not back when you were pregnant must have stunted his brain. You can't say that. No more Mrs Nice Guy, eh? No. I knew the Pollyanna act wouldn't last for long. Yeah, when I want advice from Mother of the Year, I'll ask for it. Yeah? Well, have this. On me. No! <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> oh. Home. Now. She started it. Only because she talks to me like I'm dirt. They are a disgrace. You heard the man. Move it. She's your problem. Sort her out! It's her or me, Carl. Got it? Missed. Do you want to come in? It's freezing out here. No. 
I've got loads of time. Game's just cancelled, so they sent us home early. Still, no. Kane hasn't sacked you, has he? No. Had another bust up with Paddy? Do you think that's all there is to me, him, in the garage? You didn't say that. We didn't have to. What's wrong with you? You'll find out soon enough. Would you let? Are you? I thought today was your afternoon off. You fought wrong, didn't you? I have to say, that friend of yours is very good looking. If I was 20 years younger. Oh, what the hell, 25. Who's that then? Jackman. Son. Jackson. Son. Jackson who? Jackson. He's brought your phone back. Ta da! Said you left it in the pub last night. A phone? Of course it's your phone. Almost restores one's faith in human nature. I suppose. Left his number. Didn't it? No, ring him and say thank you. I think yourself lucky you didn't spend all last night ringing Australia. <laughs>